Hello everyone and welcome back again to On Hard Channel. My name is Anas and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment as well as the message on my Instagram. And if you are wondering why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to add pages to your Shopify store. And I will show you that in two ways. The first one, which is the regular pages, the boring pages on Shopify. If you want to add the contact as page or anything that's really requires any, just the text or a couple of images that you want to add or something like that, that will be just from the Shopify dashboard. And it's really easy and simple. However, it's very limited on how much elements or how much customizable you want it to be when it comes to designing it for your Shopify store. So as I said, using that trick is only good for creating a contact as page or just a privacy policy page or anything that's related to those subjects. So in the second trick, as I said, I will show you how to create or add pages to your Shopify store that's completely customizable to your likings and it's really simple to create or design a single page on your Shopify store however you want. Either if you want it to look like your Shopify store which means the colors, layouts and so on or you want it to look like some other stores or something like that and what I mean by that is completely different landing page on your Shopify store. So here you go, the choice is yours. The first one, as I said, the regular one, just from the dashboard. And the second one is the most flexible one when it comes to designing it for your Shopify store. And without any more talking, let's just get to it. And by the way, all the things I showed you in this video will be completely free. So let's just get to it. As you can see, I'm accessing the Shopify dashboard. So the first thing you're going to do in order to create your Shopify page is head over to the online page right here, click on it and after that click on pages. And right now simply you need to click on add page right here, the green button at the top right corner, simply click on it and you should see the option to title your page as well as the content and so on. And from here you can add pictures or videos or whatever you want. However, it's very limited to the complexity of your page. So you can only add limited stuff to the page. That's why I said it's only good for creating the privacy policy page or anything that has just the text on it or a couple of pictures and that's it. So let's just create a page here. We'll call it empty. Simple as that. And just a couple of blah blah or let's just keep it blank in here for the text and let's just click on save and this is our page let's just view it and see how it looks like as you can see it's called empty and it's really empty so right now we will I will show you how to create a new page or customize this one to look like something out of this world that looks nothing like your store and to do that simply get back to the Shopify dashboard and after that click on apps in here at the bottom left corner and it will show you this prompt at the top of the screen and click on recommended apps right here and after that you can either click on Shopify app store and search for page fly and I already see it in here so here it is this is a landing page builder and you can use it to customize or create new pages with really unique designs so let's just click on it or you can search for it in here search for page fly and after that click on add app right here and give it a couple of seconds and it will install the app afterwards it will show you the dashboard for the page fly tool in order to customize page or even your shopify store and it's really easy to use so as i said let's just customize or create a new page and to show you the templates or the things that you can do actually with this and to do that simply head over to pages as you can see in here simply click on it and you will see some options here regular page home page product page and so on and we want to create a regular page so click on regular page and after that we'll ask you do you want to create a blank one in order to add elements to it whatever pictures and videos and so on and this is really good like the tool on shopify dashboard this is really good if you want to create a blank page from scratch and you can make anything you want. However, just to show you how good this template is, let's just click on create from a template and it will show us 
bunch of dumb plates here and a lot of them will be for free most of them actually will be completely free so let's just scroll down and pick page from here and uh, let's just go for it for example let's just go for this one looks like a complete different store so let's just click on it and click on select template here at the bottom right corner and here we are this is the page you can either save it or customize anything you want in here for example even the heading just click on it and change the text which is please subscribe make sure you do that so there is a lot of options you can use in here in order to customize it you can remove almost anything or add almost anything so let's just click on save in here and let's just name the title new not empty which is the opposite of our first page and click on save after that click on got it and it will save all this design into a single page on your Shopify store then I will show you how to add it to the menu if you want to and this is not published yet this is just saving so let's just click on published and it will publish the design into our page which is called not empty new not empty uh, let's just get back to our Shopify dashboard and show you how to add the page into your menu so it would be uh, visible on the header so let's just click on online store right here and after that click on navigation and from here click on main menu right here and you can add a new menu click on new, add new menu and click on the search or paste link option right here it will show you some options in here and click on pages and it will show you all the pages it didn't show up yet the new empty one yeah because it's still publishing as you can see it's still publishing so let's just select the empty one that we did create at first and after that click on add at the bottom right corner right here and click on save menu and let's just check out our store and here it is as you can see it says here empty somehow it was here not the, at the last one anyway so this is the empty page that we did create let's just check back on the page it's still actually publishing anyway you get the idea right so that's how you add pages to your Shopify store completely easy and fully customizable for your liking and for your store design and as i said if you have any questions or any video requests make sure to drop them below in a comment or check out my instagram right here below me i do reply to each comment as well as messages on my instagram and if you are wondering why is that because simply i'm working for you otherwise i think my job is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you on the next one